the EGOV 2015 is a new master plan that will see Singapore through for the, um, from 2011 to 2015. So this new master plan has uh, the vision of um, uh, driving towards a collaborative government that co-creates and connects with uh, its people. Uh, there are three trusts that support this new master plan, uh, co-create, um, connect and catalyze. The other Gov SG is part of the co-creation trust in the eGov uh, 2015 master plan. It is a first stop platform whereby the general public can discover publicly available government data sets. The objective of the portal is to uh, facilitate the uh, public to use the data sets to uh, conduct research and analysis as well as to download the available data to develop applications that uh, the general public can use. MGov at SG is the first, one of the first initiatives to be launched under the eGov Master Plan 2015. MGov at SG is the website um, that aggregates all government mobile services. One of its key features is that it is device aware, in other words, um, depending on the phone that you are holding, they will actually render the necessary services. One Inbox is part of the eGov Master Plan Co-Create Trust to improve on the service delivery okay, to the public. It's basically a uh, single platform where citizens can opt to uh, subscribe to receive electronic correspondence from government agencies. For me, the the most critical aspect of the new master plan is its focus on culture and a mind shift change. Governments have to change and governments have to open up, be more collaborative and collaborate and work more together with non-state actors, citizens. And this is a very important trend that we see today. The whole title of the new master plan is Collaborative Government. And, um, uh, and the engagement of non-state actors, citizens in particular, in the creation of knowledge, in the co-creation of knowledge, um, in the dissemination of knowledge is, is, uh, uh, is very much part of the master plan. The way of executing, implementing, we could probably learn more from Singapore in that respect. Willing to, to take faster changes and also to convince the citizens to do so. Singapore has achieved success and resonates a lot with some of our client governments in Africa and South Asia, East Asia, Latin America. Particularly this notion of co-creation with citizens, we're really moving from opening up government data sets to enabling private sector and individuals to create mobile apps, web apps, services that they care about and they use um, to improve public service. Uh, one of the most interesting uh, from the master plan itself is, is for the collaboration for the government, especially for the citizen. So it's very impressive to see the way the government of Singapore has led the development of technology and its whole drive to, draw, to increase innovation and competitiveness in the economy.